Now at six, students in Racine marched to the district office to voice concerns over what they call racial injustices. The students say that they want more inclusion for people of color in the district. Brandon Rook live from Racine with their message. Charles and Shannon, close to 100 students and community members marched side by side, calling attention to the racial inequalities they say are going on behind these doors. Now make some noise! As soon as school let out, lots of Horlick High students showed up to voice their opinions about what they're calling racial inequality at the school. It feels amazing. It feels empowering. Marching to district headquarters, students have a list of demands for the superintendent. We're tired of being discriminated of who we are. We need some changes. Yeah. What do we want? Changes! When do we want it? Now! Raleigh organizers say they're calling for a student elected position on the school board. They want to end hall sweeps and they want monitors to stop following black and brown kids because of their color. It's unfair the way we're treated, it's unfair the way we're discriminated, and this must stop. The march was followed by a rally in front of central offices, where students were supported by teachers and community activists. Moving forward, they walked right into headquarters side by side to give school leaders their demands. And this is what we want. The school district is reviewing the student demands and they say they'll be happy to meet with students to discuss in the future. Cheer for that, please. Now, Racine police were on hand to help escort the students protesting. The superintendent was not in the office this afternoon. Live from Horlick High School, Brandon Rook, today's TMJ4. All right, Brandon, thank you.